Hi, I'm Teresa with Daily Yoga, and we're going to be practicing cow face pose. So to begin, just bring your right leg out in front of you. You can have your shin parallel to the long edge of the mat. Take your left leg, stack it on top of the right. So if you can get your knees to stack relatively on top of each other, that's good. Keeping the sitting bones as firmly down on the mat as possible. If this is not going to happen for you and this is you have any pain in your ankles or knees or hips, you do not need to do it. It's equally okay to sit with your legs in fire log like this or even keeping them in Sukhasana. That's all right too. So take whatever variation of that feels the most comfortable for you where you're gonna get a nice deep stretch. And then working into the arm. So I like to have the opposite arm on top from the leg. So here I'm gonna bring my right arm up and bending at the elbow, walking my right fingertips down between my shoulder blades, okay? Then I'm gonna reach my left arm out bring the arm behind the back and maybe clasp my fingertips together. So now my arms are together behind the back. If this grip is going to be impossible for you and it's not gonna happen, easy solution. You can take a shirt, a towel, or if you happen to have a yoga strap around, you're gonna take the strap in your right hand, bring it over the head, okay? So right elbow is still up, left arm reaches behind the back, and you just grab a hold of the strap. So here, same thing, deep stretch through both shoulders, stretching the hips. And then the most important part of the pose is that you breathe. So take a moment, you've gotten yourself all wound up into this knot. We just sit, breathe, and observe what we feel in the pose. Maybe with time and with breath, you can walk yourself a little bit deeper. Next exhale, let the breath all the way out. Then inhaling will release, okay? And we're gonna switch sides. So bring the opposite leg on top. So now the right leg is gonna come on top. Again, sitting bones are both firmly down on the mat. Taking your strap if you need it on the other side, bringing the left arm up and over the head, bending the elbow. Right arm out to the side, reaching back behind you, maybe grabbing fingertips. If that's not gonna happen, just take the strap, okay? You breathe into it. And again, listen to your body. If you have any pain in the ankles, knees, or hips, then modify the seating position in a way that is going to be okay for you. Now, obviously this pose isn't the most comfortable. So there's a difference between uncomfortability and pain, sharp pain. We never want sharp pain in yoga, okay? So find a pose that's deep enough for you, that's on your edge and breathe into it. We'll take one more deep breath, inhaling, filling up all the way, sitting nice and tall. Exhale, let it go. And then slowly unwrapping yourself, okay? Unwrap your legs and we'll just finish with a nice gentle hip opening, bringing your feet together, let yourself come forward. So this just helps to release the pose, let out any tension. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, surrender. And then just walk your hands back towards you. Release the pose. Observe how you feel. Thanks for practicing with me.